snowstorm out. I've had the CF Moto out maybe four or five times before and there was only about two inches of snow. And this is the first actual time I've got to put it through, you know, something a little bit deeper than that. I think it gets up to about eight inches where we're going. And it was about, I don't know, five to 10 degrees out. Definitely a cold day. Every part of me had to be covered. Let's start off with some specs about the CF Moto 600 Touring. 41 horsepower, 37 torque, 1,000 pounds in towing, 2,500 pound winch attached to the front end. Also, comes with a ergonomic passenger seat, very comfortable I might add, power steering, and it has a ground clearance of 10.6 inches. It also comes with two-wheel drive, four-wheel drive, and a front diff lock. There's a CVT on there and it comes with park, neutral, reverse, high, and low. You may hear the microphone going in and out. There's quite a bit of snow and it keeps hitting my camera, so. Some of those snow drifts we hit back there were definitely over 10 inches. Um, I flattened quite a few of them out and to be honest I couldn't even tell that they were there. Uh, coming down that hill was pretty easy. I took it slow just because I didn't know how it was going to handle. Out here on this open dirt area I can feel a little bit of resistance just because of the traction and everything um, but really there's nothing different. So obviously I kicked it into two-wheel drive to have some fun out here. I mean, this thing puts down plenty of power to slide around. Snow, dirt, wet cement. I mean, if you've seen one of my other videos, I slid around a bit too much and I put her on her side. Uh, I was barely able to tip it up by myself there, but it has plenty of power to get some fun going out here. I was planning on heading through the park, hitting the main road, and then heading back home. But as you'll see, we have surprise after surprise stopping us from doing that.
Some other facts about the CF Moto is that it comes with LED lighting, it also has a USB and DC power outlet, it comes with 4 disc brakes, and it has 12 inch alloy wheels. Oh, fuck, I forgot we're on two. Okay. Now back to two. Go back into four. Now we're going to stay. Now I am cruising the roads in four-wheel drive, and I'm getting some really good traction here. I actually had some great acceleration coming out of that area, and uh, I mean it just handles well. It's a great vehicle overall, and you know, I've had it for about two years now, and uh, I haven't had any problems or anything at all. Thanks for stopping by and checking out our video. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button because as soon as the weather allows, we're going to be back out there camping again. So we'll see you on the next one.